out here on Diamond Valley Lake today to introduce the new Battleshad 9.0. Getting some feedback from anglers, we did a few key upgrades. It's pretty much the same body as it always has been, but we beefed it up certain locations just to help the bait last a little bit longer when you get that fish that's wilding out, thrashing around, all that good stuff. So we beefed it up in a few key areas, thinned out the tail a little bit so you get a little bit more kick action so you can really kind of feel it in the rod. And then obviously the paint, the paint's the biggest thing. The Battle Shad 7.5, we painted that. Now we have the 9.0, it's gonna be painted. In addition to the Chaos Air Chamber, the Stealth Mode Weighted Hook Slot, these were unique to the Battle Shad baits when we introduced them. But the newest concept is now we have a harness built in to the head of this bait allowing you to put hooks on and off twist them in twist them out it's gonna last it's gonna make your baits last 10 times longer you may still get one here and there that breaks down but i tell you these baits last so much longer now so when all the other me too acts start coming out of the woodwork making their own twisted version of it this is where you saw it first i'm going to demonstrate it to you real quick how much of a game changer this is this is just Generic blank one, it's a blim, just whatever. So if you had a normal beast hook with the twist lock spring in there and you gave it some serious pulling, it would have already pulled out by this point. But I'm gonna keep yanking on this thing and eventually what's gonna happen is the bait is gonna rip in half. Look at that head right now. I'm putting a lot of pressure, but I'm gonna keep going. Watch, bait just rips in half. And you can see in there, you have a harness. It's gonna make the baits last so much longer. I'm putting a lot of force on it in order to rip that bait apart. Back to this one, it's fairly simple and straightforward. Take your spring lock off of your beast hook. You have a gap here, thread it on there. Clicks right in. Take a pair of pliers that I got right here and then just pinch that screw eye closed just enough so that that hook's not gonna pop on out of there. There, it's pretty much squeezed shut now if you can see. The hook's not gonna come out of there. Now, you could just rig it this way or if you wanna button that bait down a little bit more and just take your pliers and just twist it on a little bit tighter however you want. Make sure it's kind of centered how you always would. And you're just gonna take that hook, feed it straight up into the bait, boom. And then this is something I, I know a lot of guys struggle with a lot, but I always just kind of feel around in here, push it forward, find where I want that hook to pop out, and boom. Oh, look at that, look at that. Does it get any more snagless? That's it right there. And now with the added durability up here in the head, lights out, dude. This is this is what changes it all up. Now, me personally, I like to bend the hook up a little bit. I think it helps you connect with the, those fish. So you just get in here, grab on both sides, and just pull them out. And I'm actually gonna pull it on out of here. That way I can get a little bit better grab on it. Sometimes these hooks are so tough that you end up bending your pliers. So make sure you got some strong pliers. Sometimes these little ones end up bending and you're bummed. So that should work pretty well. And just feeding it right back up in there. Boom. Yeah, that's how I like it now. See how that hook point's sticking up just a little bit? And just like I said before, you got the stealth mode hook slot, the chaos air chamber, allows the bait to fully collapse, those fish are gonna get stuck. And now we got the head case harness. It's gonna allow you to use baits for so much longer without the nose blowing out. If you're gonna end up wanting to take this hook off this bait, it takes a little bit of work, but I think that's the sacrifice we can make in order to have a bait lasting so much longer. Take it out and just twist it on back out. You just basically need to open up the space to then pry that eye open. Or you can just take it all the way off if you really wanted to. See, it's twisting on out, but I don't need to do that. I'm gonna end up fishing this thing. I'm twisting it back on now. I can really button it down here if I want. There we go. So that that bait is all the way tight. And so, boom, feeding it back in, grabbing this back end here, pushing down here, feeding it up, and boom, there goes the hook. Pops on out. No stretch face. Nice, clean, flush right there, straight in line, we're ready to rock. That's the new Battle Shad 9.0, head case harness, chaos air chamber, stealth mode hook slot, 
twist tail. That's the complete package for the big bites. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, I'll do my best to answer them. And if you have been missing the content, haven't been seeing it, make sure you're subscribed. Thanks, and I'm out.